So let's consider this question here, practice now six. Given a triangle ABC, angle B is given as this, angle C, this, and BC is 12.5. Uh, the first part of the question involves finding angle A. Now, this is easy because we already have the angles, uh, angle B and angle C. So, it's just a matter of using uh, some angle sum triangle. So, let's find angle A first. This part 1, angle A equals to 180 degrees minus 58.3 degrees minus 39.4 degrees. And you'll get the answer. 2.3 degrees and since this is geometry um, you of course have to give the reason why so in this case here it is angle sum of triangle okay so let's look at part two now in this case you're supposed to find length of AB okay you're supposed to find this length over here okay and you can see here that this length over here is opposite of angle C, all right? Now we've already gotten this angle over here, which is angle A, right? And this is 82.3. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna use sine rule to find length of AB. So it goes like this, AB over the sine of angle C is equals to BC over the sine of angle A. Okay, so we're going to substitute all these values in and try to find AB. Let's do the substitution. AB over the sine of 39.5 four degrees equals to BC which is 12.5 over the sine of 82.3 and then we move things around using algebra so this becomes 12.5 let's move this sine upstairs sine 39.4 over sine 82.3 put degree symbols here and you will get this as approximately equal to 8.0063 which is we round off to 3SF in this case here it is 8.01 centimeters so that should be the length of AB okay so let's do part three. We're supposed to find the length of AC. Okay. Having a look at the diagram again, the length of AC over the sine of angle B is equals to uh, BC again over the sine of angle A. Okay, so let's do the substitution. Eh? In this case here. AC over sine 58.3 degrees is equals to BC is 12.5 again over sine a 2.3 degrees and then that's again let's move things around using algebra AC equals to 12.5 sine 58.3 degrees over sine 82.3 degrees and you get a length of approximately 10.732 which is about the same as 10.7 cm round off to 3sf okay and that'll be your answers